Ben stropping tablets is used to treat symptoms of Parkinson's disease or involuntary movements due to the side effects of certain psychiatric drugs. Antipsychotics such as chlorpromazine and haloperidol. Benzotropin belongs to a class of medication called anticholinergics that works by blocking a certain natural substance, acetylcholine. This helps decrease muscle stiffness, sweating, and the production of saliva, and helps improve walking ability in people with Parkinson's disease. Anticholinergics can stop severe muscle spasms of the back, neck, and thighs that are sometimes caused by psychiatric drugs. It can also decrease other side effects such as muscle stiffness, rigidity, extrapyramidal signs, APS. It is not helpful in treating movement problems caused by tidal dyskinesia and MAO versus them. Benzotropin should not be used by children younger than 3 years. Indications Medications often used to treat bipolar disorders such as typical and atypical antipsychotic drugs may cause drug-induced Parkinsonism, the medical term of symptoms that mimic Parkinson's disease. Drug-induced Parkinsonism may cause a decrease in facial expressions, difficulty starting and controlling movement, slowed movement, soft voice, stiffness of the trunk, arms or legs, tremor. How to use Benzotropin tablets are taken by mouth either once a day or a single dose at bedtime or two to four times a day with meals. This medication should also be taken at least one hour before taking an antacid or anti-diarrhea medication, which may affect how benzotropin is absorbed. The doctor will often start you at a lower dose and may gradually increase this dose to achieve the desired effect. Treatment is often initiated at a lower dose and decreased by 0.5 mg increments every 5 to 6 days until reaching a dose that provides optimal relief without excess side effects. A typical dose for adults is 1 to 4 mg once or twice per day. You should always take only the amount that your doctor has prescribed. Your specific dosage will depend on your needs, age and weight. The timing of the dosage may also vary depending on your individual needs. For some individuals, a full dose taken right before bed produces their best result. Others find that they need a divided dose taken at different points during the day to help manage their symptoms. If you miss a dose, take it as soon as you remember, unless it is almost time for your next dose. If that is the case, simply skip the mixed dose. Don't take two doses at once. Contraindications you should not use benzotropin if you are allergic to it, not approved for use by anyone younger than 3 years old. Tell a doctor if you have ever had an enlarged prostate, urination problems, glaucoma or muscle problems. All the adults may be more sensitive to the effects of benzotropin. It is not known if benzotropin will harm an unborn baby. Tell a doctor if you are pregnant or plan to become pregnant. Tell a doctor if you are breastfeeding. Precautions Benzotropin may interact with certain drugs, including antidepressants, sleeping pills, painkillers, antihistamines, antidiarrheal medications, some antacids, and other medications. If a driving or has this activity until now, how benzotropin will affect you. Your actions could be impaired. Avoid becoming overheated or dehydrated during exercise and in hot weather. Benzotropin can decrease sweating and you may be more prone to heat stroke. Benzotropin side effects. Get emergency medical help if you have signs of an allergic reaction, hives, difficulty breathing, swelling of a face, lips, tongue, or throat. Benzotropin may cause serious side effects. Call doctor at once if you have dry mouth that causes trouble talking or swallowing, little or no urination, uncontrolled muscle movements, vomiting, severe constipation, fast heart beats, muscle weakness, blurred vision, tunnel vision, eye pain, or seeing house around lights, confusion, hallucinations, or severe skin rash.